Hey guys, it's Ashley. In this video, I'm gonna be doing a kind of mermaid look. I was actually requested quite a bit to do this, so I'm gonna do it today. I'm actually pretty excited because I have somewhat of an idea of what I'm gonna do, and I feel like it'll turn out pretty cool. But you never know. I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do, so let's just get started. My makeup is off and my hair is out of my face, and now let's move on to primer. So for primer, I'm using the Smashbox Radiance Primer. Since I'm really not doing anything special with my eyebrows because it's not necessary, I'm gonna use my Anastasia Brow Wiz along with my Essence Clear Brow Gel, just like normal. Now comes the fun part, which is the eyes. So I'm gonna use the Wen Wild Concealer. I just got this today, so I haven't used it, and I'm really excited to try it. Also, if you're wondering, I got the shade Light Ivory, which is the lightest shade, and it's really not that light, but I think I can work with it. I'm also quickly setting them with my finger with the Cody Airspun powder. That was not a good idea, but... So for the eye look, I'm going to be using the Jaclyn Hill palette and the NYX Ultimate Brights palette. So I'm first going to go in with the Jaclyn Hill palette and use this light transition shade. Next, I'm taking the shade this purple shade from the NYX Ultimate Brights palette and I'm just gonna be putting it like on the outer part of my eyes so like out here in the crease wow where are you at girl and then I'm gonna take this kind of light teal shade and put it on the inner part of my eyelid now I'm taking this shade in the Jaclyn Hill palette and taking a more like focus brush it's the Morphe M433 brush and I'm just gonna take it and put it like more into the crease here because the other shade was like kind of a little too light i'm now going in with the like royal purple shade and i went ahead and sprayed my brush and i'm going to put it on the outer kind of corner of my eye outer half area then of course i'm going in with this shade i'm putting it right here Ooh, dang girl and since i'm using such a precise brush it's really easy to like do a cut crease but like without using concealer you know i'm gonna use the pencil brush and take the shade right here and i'm gonna put it on the inner corner in my brow bone so we're pretty much done with the eyes and now i'm gonna move on to foundation so i'm gonna use the wet n wild photo focus foundation in the shade nude ivory for concealer i'm again gonna use the wet n wild photo focus has pretty good coverage so far so far i am really liking the concealer i would recommend it so far but just put it on but next i'm going to use some of the cody airspun powder so to really make this look like a mermaid i'm going to take this type of like sort of mesh stuff but like i don't really know if it'll work but i'm going to try to apply my bronzer and blush with it this could be interesting okay i highly Oh, that did not work. Yeah, you can barely see the scales. Never mind on that. So, what was wrong with that is that, like, the mesh was way too tiny. So, like, you can barely see it anyways. And now I have a ton of bronzer and blush on. The bronzer that I used was the NARS Casino bronzer. And then the blush that I used was from the Tarte Blush Bazaar palette. And I took the shade Exhilarating. The highlighter I'm going to use is from the Aurora Glow Kit by Anastasia. And I'm going to use the purple shade and Luna. And I'm actually going to spray it too to make it even more out there. This glow when you spray it. I'm gonna try to apply some e.l.f. eyeliner. This is like the shimmer eyeliner pencil. I'm not sure of the shade, but it's like a metallic teal color. That did not work. Now we're gonna move on to mascara. I'm just gonna curl my eyelashes and then apply the Essence False Lash Mascara and then apply some fake eyelashes like out here, but you'll, you'll see. So I cut a pair of fake eyelashes in half and I'm just gonna put them on the outer part of my eyelashes because literally I didn't have a pair of eyelashes. So I just cut them in half. And hopefully this will just make my eyelashes look more full. I'm really excited. That turned out how I wanted it to. Um, so now I'm going to put like a little jewel here. You know what? Why not go big or go home? So I'm going to take these kind of small jewels and like put eyelash glue to adhere them to my face. We're finally on to lips. So for lips, I'm going to use this kind of darky purple NYX liquid suede in the shade... I cannot pronounce this. Subversocial. I 
think that's the shade. And then I'm gonna put on this Jordana Cosmic Glow Holographic Lip Gloss in the shade Cosmic Opal on. I never use this, but like, look at how pretty it is. I already like this just by itself, but with the lip topper over it once it dries. Okay, so this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. I loved filming this video, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching it as much as I had fun filming it. Um, if you like more exotic looks like this, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already because that would mean so much to me. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!